Hey guys, it's Kate, your Plastic Free Mermaid, and I'm here with Ocean Ramsey. We're at the, we're live from Asia Dive Expo here in Singapore. How are you? Good, good. Thanks for having me. Aloha everyone. And I wish you were here, and thank you for supporting this beautiful mermaid here. And uh, she's leading by example and not using single-use plastic. So it's like plastic straws, reusable water bottles are so great to travel with. I'm traveling with my own all the time. There's just like really simple little ways, but you can seriously see thousands, millions of animals. It all adds up every single day, every single year. Mm, so true. And in your experience, you swim with sharks every day. I'm so lucky I get to swim with sharks every single day. And sometimes we see whales and dolphins. And the sad thing is, is that we see plastic bags drifting through all the time. And I've even seen like syringes and the most random single-use plastics um, drifting by. And here you have these beautiful dolphins, sharks, and it's just the beauty and the purity of nature, and it's just kind of corrupted by, I mean, plastic. Mm. By this convenience, this, this addiction we have to, um, to convenience, to single use, to just like something quick and easy at our fingertips. So it's just planning ahead, getting a little bit creative, and um, using less plastics. And so, like spending time with sharks, what's your, what's your favorite thing about what you do? Sharks are so beautiful and unique. There's really nothing like them. I would have to say I do have some favorite sharks, although I don't like to play favorites. But um, great whites, tigers, bull sharks, sandbar sharks, and Galapagos. And I have specific individuals that I've known for over 10 years of growing up with them and getting to know them as individuals. It just really, really has deepened my perspective and appreciation for them. Um, if you guys have an opportunity to come visit me in Hawaii, we have a program. You can come out and swim with me with the sharks potentially dolphins and whales too. It's called One Ocean Diving. Um, you can check it out on Instagram as well. But it's a great opportunity to learn about sharks from a scientific standpoint. You get to learn about them um, from a conservation standpoint as well. And you get to spend time in the water with them. They're so incredible. Once you get to lock eyes with them and, and see what they're really like, you'll fall in love. Oh, sounds amazing. And is there any uh, conservation projects that you're working on? You were just in Hong Kong where you saw all the fins and... Yeah, what that, that was anything? really hard. So we were filming um, shark deterrence in Australia before. We've been filming uh, for a conservation film called Saving Jaws. It's on Instagram, Saving Jaws Movie. And uh, we went to Hong Kong and it was... There were more fins than I ever would have imagined. And that was bags and bags and boxes and boxes of store after store, street after street. And it was horrifying. And, and some of them were still uh, colored so I could see white shark fins, spring whites. Uh, whale sharks, basking sharks were really uh, prevalent. Um, the hammerheads, the hammerheads are very targeted. And many shark populations around the world, actually most large species, are declined by over 90%. So sharks really need all the help they can get right now. Um, they can die of plastic ingestion, especially the whale shark, which is an endangered species. They're filter feeders, so they're just opening and closing their mouth indiscriminately feeding, and they're trying to go off with of little tiny plankton, but you can think about the little tiny bits of plastic they can ingest as well. So it's, I mean, really the plastic problem affects everyone and everything. It's so scary. I do a whale shark retreat in Exmouth every year in oh, WA. Amazing. They're so beautiful, they're so beautiful to spend time. Here. Try not to play favorites, but they're so cool. <laughs> they're really cool. Um, just gentle giants. Mm. So, is there anything that that people that are interested in getting involved with saving sharks or preventing shark finning or helping some of the endangered species that you would recommend how they get involved? Yeah, if you guys want to make a difference, it's really simple. Go online, sign some petitions, um, check out your local government, and write to your local government. If your area doesn't currently ban shark finning, because that's the number one killer of sharks, please, please, please write to your local government. We're trying to get it banned all around the world. If you know anyone that actually consumes the soup or the meat, it's actually toxic for them, so just educating them about that would be really, really good. Um, if you do social media, which hopefully you do if you're tuning into this, use the hashtags help save sharks and also the bad hashtags like shark fishing and uh, shark fin soup because then we can take over the bad hashtags. So people that are searching to go shark fishing or for the soup will hopefully find a post from you about the importance of sharks. And sharks are so important for the ocean. Um, they're basically like the immune system. So we need to protect them because without your immune system, we get sick and die. And that's the same thing that's happening with fish stock populations. Mm. 
so amazing. Thank you so much, Ocean, for all the work you thank do. Thank you for what you're doing. Mm. And thank you for everyone out there watching and getting involved. That's right, you guys. We can all make a difference. We all make such an impact, even with each day that we live, each plastic that we get rid of in our lives. So get involved in your local community. Get involved in government. Um, right? Like, like Ocean said, to your government officials, use hashtags. Just get involved, be vocal about these issues because they really matter. Um, and never doubt yourself. You can do anything. We are all like beautiful citizens of this planet and we all matter. Our voices all matter. So. Everyone can make an impact and together we make an even greater one. That's right. So I hope you're inspired by beautiful ocean and definitely go visit her in Hawaii. I certainly hope to. Thank you. Thanks for everything. <laughs> My pleasure. See you guys.